Hey, Mark Rice here and I just started a big game design project. For that project I'm gonna create a bunch of different characters. And those characters need to be so small, so I need to delete all the necessary details. And I will show you today how you can do that as well. Ok, first I will pick up the skin color. Hit M on the keyboard and create a rectangle. Ok. Then I will copy the shape with Ctrl plus C, Ctrl plus F command and move this point here. So this will be the beard and it will be black. Select these points, something like this and make these corners round. It will be bold. Ok, cool. Here I will create one more rectangle. Ok, it will be black as well. And this corner will be round. Ok, cool. Hit M on the keyboard and create one more rectangle here. Something like this. And that's it, I just created the head. This is all what I need for that character. Now I will show you how you can create arms. So I'll group these shapes, move it here. Ok, I create the rectangle here. It will be orange. Ok, copy it. The new one will be yellow. And copy it one more time. For the new shape I will need skin color. Cool. Here I'll create the thumb. Ok. The arm is created. So I will group these shapes. Here I will change the size of the head, something like this, ok beautiful, and now I will draw the body, ok I will use the orange color for it and make this chorus round. Ok, cool. So now I need some kind of weapon. So I'll draw it. And because I will create so small character, I need a big weapon. Ok. Beautiful. Ok, that's it. Now I will copy the front arm for the back arm. Move it here, delete this part, this part as well, and send to back. It's time to start with legs. So here will be the first part of the front leg. Copy it. And here I can add one triangle. So I will draw the square, rotate it and delete this point here with the pen tool, something like this, beautiful. And now copy these shapes for the back leg. Send to back. This part will be even more black and this part will be darker as well. Select the shapes and send to back. Ok, I will add the shadow 
and basically that's it. As you can see it's pretty simple, but if I change the size it will be even better. Okay, look at this, and it's perfect for the game design. So, I hope that you like it, if you want to download it for free, just check out the link below, and stay tuned, because the best is yet to come. Oh yeah!